Oh, Todd. Come in here. What's wrong? What's wrong? <laughs> Let me get your tissue. Let me get my makeup for you and everything. <laughs> Honey, I thought you were gorgeous when you didn't have makeup on. <laughs> That's why I like you. Oh, I like you too. <laughs> He's always on it. Um, <laughs> so we, um, uh, in two weeks I got my MRI. Uh -huh. And then, um, hopefully the following week. So I gotta wait till next week to. Let's play with the appointment. So. so tell us a little bit kind of what brought you to this group in the first place. Sure. So I actually, I live in Carlisle and um, I had felt a lump in my leg and I went to um, get it checked out and I found out they have, I have a very rare cancer called a pleomorphic leosarcoma high grade, which is a very aggressive. And um, so they sent me here for radiation and that's how I ended up here. Okay. Can you tell us a little bit about your first experience, you know, from the staff that you met right when you came in? Sure. So, um, you know, it's, it's funny because um, they were super nice um, just from the very beginning. Like, you know, you're, you're, you're entering a world that you know nothing about and you're scared um, and then you meet these guys who just consistently are showing like positive support, encouragement, and they don't know anything about me, but they take the time to really help me. Yes, awesome. Can you share with me, or just with the, the folks maybe watching a little bit about what makes you grateful? You know, um, I find myself to be a very positive person and I can really self-motivate myself, but a couple weeks into this, I was really down, and oh, why me? Yeah. And, uh, you know, I have a little little guy at home, and, you know, am I going to be around to see him grow up? And you just really get down on yourself. And I came in here, and I, I shared that with them. And just, they all came and hugged me. You know, not just from the radiation text, but like Jocelyn and Kathy and just, they all came and they like literally like a group hug and we're here for you and we're going to support you and you're going to get through this and don't even think like that. And, and you know, like we've seen this, you're going to be fine. And you know, just, just getting that type of encouragement, I, I've never left here without feeling good about myself, ever. And it's only because of them. What would you want to tell somebody else that is going through this journey? Um, you know, number one, you have to be your own advocate. Um, I just want to share a quick story that I, uh, because this is a very rare cancer, um, it's not really seen in this area and I do have to go to a sarcoma specialist. And the closest one to us is um, in New York. And my, I've been fighting with my insurance um, and had to be my own advocate for that. But um, Kathy specifically here, I've never had anyone who worked for a doctor's office fight so hard for me to the point where literally two, three times a day she was calling me, letting me know where we are, what we stand. I mean, she showed me a, literally a notebook full of notes and it's, it's all because I asked her to fight and she wanted to fight. She put herself in my shoes. Um, you know, so I always say be your own advocate and then number two, just trust the process. You know, other people have been here before. I know it might be new to us, but other people have been here before us. So trust the process, trust the doctors. And you know, if there's a question, ask, because I've questioned some things, but ask and, and you know, they'll help you. I wanted to do something because I would have not have been able to do the last five weeks without you. Oh. And the two of you guys have just been, Oh, I'm here. sorry. I'm sorry. Don't be crying. This is a happy day. Oh my goodness, no. girl. You got through it. But oh, honestly, I'm so proud of you. I know the first three weeks I would come in, I could barely even sit. But look how far you've come. I know. But I just want to say thank you because when I had like, my worst days, I came in here and you guys made it the best day. So I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much. You I made my sister make you yeah. bop level. So, <laughs> so this is for you. Oh, and that's for you. Oh, so much.
And so Wait. I did bring an extra one because I know that she's been, she's back. And, okay. You know, but I just want to say thank you guys you for are everything. So and I asked uh, the marketing team to come out here and so they could just well, spotlight you. you guys to the rest of the world and say how amazing you are. So. You were wonderful. You did that. Spotlight's on you, girlfriend. <laughs> yeah, you did the work. And I did my makeup. And I did my makeup. And you brought so, mom along. And I brought yeah, mom along. And I brought mom along. And I brought mom along. And I brought mom You should be proud yeah. of yourself. Thanks. You put the work in. You remember your first day coming in and how painful that was? Look at you now. Thank this you. Is, this is an accomplishment. And you did okay? it. Yeah. It's another part this of the This is journey. why I love you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get this done.